And here's the cows coming in to get their last meal. My neighbor should be by here pretty soon to get them loaded up. We have to have them there between 7 and 9 a.m. this morning. And here comes the other two stragglers. Come on. Here, cow. How in the f are you freaking kidding me? Are you freaking kidding me? <sighs> I'm flipping believable. I cannot believe that they did this again. Oh my God. They've tore down the fence again after we already repaired it and destroyed the chicken coop area again. I cannot believe this. This is why I'm not too upset about them going to get processed today. I thought, oh my God, it's unbelievable. Unbelievable. You guys are destructor cows. Seriously, how in the hell did you get in here? Did you crawl over the fence? Go. Go. Go! My God! How unbelievable! <sighs> I tell you, you gotta have a Fort Knox fence to keep freaking cows out of the chicken coop. <sighs> How do they do that? I gotta fix that later. I can't do it with holding a phone in my hand. Unbelievable. You guys. Oh my God. Oh look. See where the plant's flying. Oh well. So, as I was saying, this is the last day they're going to go to the processors today. And after these past couple days, I am glad, in one hand, because I've had to repair stuff around here. Every single day, it just seems like I'm getting into stuff. The bull in a china shop uh, saying is somewhat true, especially for these three and that one. I always give my neighbor a hard time, but they're a cow. I call him the instigator. <laughs> But you can see they look pretty good. I mean, they've gained quite a bit of weight. And uh, hopefully we'll get quite a bit of beef off of them. So, it's sad that I said that they're going, but this is the reason we were raising them. And I'll probably be filming the trip to the slaughterhouse today also. So, uh, I'll let you see how that process goes. And again, I say thanks for stopping by and thanks to all those people who have subscribed. I really appreciate it. And I will see you in the next video. Thanks for watching.